Hello everyone. Today we are going to show you how to add the IPC to the SDR through web. So first of all, let's take a look what we need in this process. This is our Hackvision HighWatch Series IPC. This is our Hackvision HighWatch Series NVR. And this is our PoE switch, which has already connected to available network and another three network cables. Also, we will need a Windows PC. So what we need to do in this process is to connect the IPC to the switch, also connect the NVR to the switch, and connect the computer to the same network. So let's start. Okay, done. Okay, after connected, please make sure your computer has enabled the DHCP. Now let's come to the software SADP Tour. You can also download this software from our official website. First of all, let's activate the devices. Let's choose a device and set a new password for it. Confirm it. And activate. OK, this pop-up window is just for password resetting in case you will need it someday. Enable the DHCP and enter the password. Modify. Now let's activate another device and set a new password for it. Confirm it. Activate. Okay, it's the same, just for password resetting. Let's enable the DHCP and enter the password. Modify. Let's click refresh. We can find the IP address has changed. Next, let's open the IE browser. Let's input the IP address of the NVR. If you don't know it, actually you can find it here. Okay, when we see this note, Please download the new version of plugin. Click OK and run it. OK. Finish. Let's reopen the IE browser. OK, input the IP address of the NVR again. Now, input admin. 
and password. Login. Okay, choose the configuration. Let's choose the system and camera management. Add. Now let's input the IP address of the IP camera. And input the password. Click OK. As we can see in the status, it shows connecting. Let's just wait seconds or refresh the page. Now we can see it shows online. It means succeed. Next, let's go to the live view. Double click the camera and we can see the live view. If there are several cameras, just click here to set different channels live views. Okay, thank you, that's all.